Hey, everyone. Today, we're addressing a common concern the iPhone 11 screen, not responding to touch or a frozen display. If you recently updated your iPhone 11 to the latest iOS version and encountered similar screen issues, don't worry. We've got solutions for you. Stick around as we walk you through the troubleshooting steps. First, here is a trick. Utilize voice control via Siri. If your screen remains unresponsive, but you have to use your phone like right away, Siri may be a helpful ally. You can indeed ask Siri to turn on voice control or perform certain tasks if you already had these Siri settings on. Activate Siri by saying, Hey Siri, or by holding the side button. Then, try commands like turn on voice control or open settings. Siri can assist in navigating and executing actions without requiring touch input. Okay, let's get back to the recovery process. Method 1. Force restart your iPhone 11. In case you haven't tried this, try attempt to force restart. Quickly press and release the volume up button, followed by the volume down button. Then, keep press and hold the side button until you see the Apple logo. Don't touch the screen and slide to power off. Check if your screen responds after the restart. Method 2. Ensure a clean screen and disconnect accessories. Make sure your screen is clean and free of any obstructions. Disconnect any cable that linked to your iPhone 11. If the problem solved, try using a different cable or charger. Method 3. Repair iOS with Reiboot. If that still doesn't resolve the issue, consider repairing your iOS using Reiboot. Reiboot is a flexible software crafted to tackle diverse system issues on iOS E, iPad OS and TV OS platforms. Without the need for a force restart or data loss, Reiboot can help you with your frozen screen issue, keeping your happy memory all safe like pics from your last trip or else. We the linked one below if you want to try it. Let's move on. Connect your iPhone to a computer, launch Reiboot. Follow the on-screen instructions to enter recovery mode, just like force restart, but press longer with the side button until you see the restore screen. Once it detected your phone, click system repair. Download the latest firmware and then click standard system now. This won't result in any data loss. Reiboot will initiate the repair process and once completed, your iPhone will be back to normal. Method 4. Update iPhone using iTunes. Put your device into recovery mode and select the update option in iTunes. This will download and install the latest firmware. Your iPhone will be back to normal. Method 5. Seeking official repair. If none of the aforementioned methods prove successful in resolving the issue, it is highly likely that there might be damage to the screen. In such cases, the most viable course of action is to seek official repair services. The only remaining option is to have the screen professionally repaired. If you find yourself in this situation, reaching out to authorized service centers or contacting Apple support is advisable for a solution to your iPhone screen-related concerns. That's it for today's troubleshooting guide. We hope these steps help in resolving the touchscreen issues on your iPhone 11. If you found this information useful, give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more tech tips. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. Thanks for watching and until next time, take care.